Hello, Pranita Fanboy here, and today I am going to review Ultraman Taro, or as they say in Japan, Ultraman Taro. Now, um, this is the sixth uh, Ultra series, which first aired in Japan back in 1973, and it consists of, I think, 53 episodes. Now, um, the first episode starts um, by introducing a man named, oh yes, Higashi Kotaro. He was um, returning uh, to Japan from something I forgot what was he was doing, but um, well, he was swimming in the ocean, or maybe it was the sea, but um, a ship came and picked him up, and then uh, eventually uh, they arrived in Japan. Oh, and um, there is a, well, he became friends with a captain named, um, the, oh yes, uh, Kadem Shiotori. Now, um, let's see. Oh yes, um, eventually, uh, he met up with these people who are part of an organization called Sato. Now, uh, Sato's job is to uh, protect uh, the city, from, to protect people from kaiju attacks and alien invasions. Uh, also, uh, well, uh, the Sato members, they, uh, well, their uniforms are like uh, blue red stripes. Now, the men, well, pants are part of the uniforms. And for the women, well, skirts are part of their uniforms. But anyway, um, eventually there was a kaiju attack, and um, uh, oh yes, um, well, yes, Kotaro, he uh, he went out of the kaiju uh, to fight it, and then uh, he was well. Knocked down. I mean, he survived, but then uh, the next day, well, um, he was um, found lying down at his school park or schoolyard. I mean, and well, he woke up and was wondering how he got there. Now, uh, eventually, he met up with uh, this woman. Uh, well, he, uh, the woman he help uh, Godaro and uh, with his wounds and then uh, give Godaro a pendant now, uh, now because of uh, Godaro's bravery he was officially made a member of Sato and well the people uh, who are part of Sato well they are a um, Oh yes, uh, a man named uh, Asahina Yutaro, he is the captain. Then we have a, uh, oh yes, a man named Dambara Tatuo, uh, a man named Kitajima, Kitajima Tats, uh, Tetsuya, a woman named, uh, oh yes, uh, Moriyame, Moriyama Izumi, or Izumi, I mean, uh, a man named Ueno Takichi. Oh yes, a man named Arekaki Shuhei, and uh, a man named the uh, oh yes, uh, Nishida Yiro. Now, uh, in the next attack, well, uh, Godro was uh, doing his part, but this time around, well, um, he was killed. However, there came, appeared um, this older being. She, her name is uh, Urudaro no Haha, which means Mother of Ultra. And well, um, she brought, uh, oh yes, um, Kotaro to the M78 Nebula to 
the land of Odra. And uh, well, uh, over there, the uh, previous Odra heroes uh, were there, and well, uh, Uldaru no Haha, well, uh, he uh, uh, told uh, her sons how they were, each of them were born, and using the same process with Kodoro's body. And eventually, um, Kodoro, he was brought back to life and became the host of a new older hero. Then Kodoro, he, um, oh yes, uh, returned to Earth and, uh, Henshin and do Udrumon Taro and defeated the first Kaiju of the series. Oh, and also, um, he was offered a place to live in during his time as a Sato member, and turns out it was a house of, um, oh, yes, Captain Shiodori. And also, Shiodori, he has two children. A daughter named, um, oh yes, uh, Saotori, and uh, uh, she's an adult, and a son named Kinichi. He's a, a boy of elementary school age. Yeah. Just like uh, the other previous older series, Yes, we have the hero fighting kaijus and alien invaders. But, you know, there were some um, new things in this as well. Let's see, um... Oh, yes, um... No, uh, Many episodes later, there was a, um... Well... Oh, yes, a, a, a two-part episode where, um... The previous Uduro brothers arrive on Earth in their human forms or Ninkin forms and um, yes to meet up with um, Hika Kodoro. Now, uh, and then um, part of the episode, well, um, some of those Sato members um, were killed by uh, an alien. And well, of course, uh, the previous older brothers, they uh, decided to take the form of the Sato members and return to Sato. And well, uh, oh yes, uh, Ruder and Taro, he eventually feared that, you know, they, uh, and then we end that episode, and then, um, well, uh, because of that, he became, well, he became arrogant and thinks he doesn't need help from anybody. And then in the next episode, well, um, the older brother decided not to help him, but when, um, Taro, well, he immediately needed help, and, well, then he got a help, and he learned the importance of teamwork. Let's see, um, episodes later, there was the, um, oh yes, um, it was a New Year episode, and, um, uh, well, we have the, uh, well, uh, the, uh, let's see, oh yes, um, the Chichi, uh, Utero no Chichi, which means, Father of Ultra, he appeared along with uh, oh, Minami Yuko, who was one of the hosts of Uderman Aisu, but then left, uh, you know, Earth to join her people. But uh, she did return to Earth, you know, to help out. Oh, I forgot to mention that um, earlier in the series, uh, Uduru no Aha, she uh, did well, uh, only appear to give uh, Tarot guidance 
Oh, and I forgot to mention that um, the woman who helped um, Tower with his wounds, I mean, uh, Kodro with his wounds in the first episode, well, um, well, Tower said that she looks a lot like his mother. And, well, this, uh, yeah, that this could be the human form of Utaro no Haha. No, I read the New Year's episode. Well, um, oh yes, I mean, I mean, um, I mean, during the series, uh, there was some kind of romance that was going on between, um, oh yes. Kotoro and, um, uh, let's see, oh yes, uh, uh, Saudori. Oh, and I forgot to mention that, well, um, uh, oh yes, uh, Captain uh, Ishidori, well, he left, uh, you know, on a, uh, for what it was, but, you know, it was for his, uh, as part of his duty, and, yeah, so, um, uh, Saudori was, a. Uh, left to uh, take care of uh, oh, Kenichi and Kenichi would uh, also refer to uh, or look to uh, Kodoro as an older brother of course there were times when uh, Kenichi well uh, uh, he was uh, you know uh, unhappy that you know his mother is dead and his father is not around, but um, eventually he uh, learned to accept how things are and now let it get, get him down. Now, uh, see, uh, oh, yes, there were, I think there were a few episodes where um, some of the baby older brothers came to help out, but um. Yeah, it's been a while since I've seen that series, but anyway, um, let's see, oh, yes, I did, uh, sometime I did the New Year episodes. Let's see, oh yes, uh, it's getting closer to the um, end of the series. Well, um, it's been revealed that um, the ship that uh, Captain Shodori was on. Oh no, before that, um, there was another ship of, uh, who, and there was um, a man who was the father of a friend of Kirichi, and um, he was a, uh, see, uh, oh yes, um, when he first uh, heard about it, well, he um, was mad that Sato and Rutum and Taro didn't, uh, prevent it from happening and uh, then another ship which was the one that Captain Shodori was on he was also um uh, was also at that by in and, and a guy you and um well once the uh well go to first he didn't want to um uh, can you do uh, final just yet you know because you know I haven't reacted, but then uh, a phone call uh, arrived at the uh, Shirodori household, and well, Sarutori, she, once she uh, answered it and heard the news, she was uh, upset and, uh, let's see, oh yes, Genichi saw how she was uh, acting, and well, Luna Kodoro had no choice but to tell Kenichi what happened and oh, Kenichi was upset that uh, his father was killed and became mad at both Sato and Doro just like his friend was and well uh, of course uh, Kodoro he didn't like the uh, I mean, well, uh, he didn't want uh, Kinichi to, you know, spend his whole life in anger and he talked to him and then revealed 
to Kanishita, he is Uturaman Taro. And um, also, what you know, told Kanichi to um, be brave and you know, to not let that, you know, what happened, you know, ruin his life. And then, uh, Kotaro, he, uh, yes, he, uh, Henshin and Taro and, um, fought the final kaiju of the series. Oh, I forgot to mention that, um, episodes before that, um, the, uh, let's see, uh, what was, I should remember the name, um, it was, um, Oh yes, uh, the, uh, oh, Yapuro, he came back, uh, only one episode, but of course, he was defeated. Now, back to the series finale, yes, he defeated and, uh, well, when he, oh, I forgot to mention something else, that, uh, a new member, Dusado, was added, his, it was a man named, oh yes, uh, Nidani Kazumi, yes, he joined, uh, later in the series. Now, uh, after the battle with the Kaiju, well, um, well, Taro, uh, well, he decided to leave, I mean, uh, Kodoro, he decided to leave Sado, and, um, yes, because he wanted to, um, uh, well, I forgot what it was, but, um, eventually, Oh, and he also gave up his pendant because, well, um, he didn't need it anymore. Uh, because, well, he didn't fight at Taro, but then, that was his last, well, as uh, Alderman Taro, but then, um, he decided to defeat the Kaiju, you know, as a, in his human form. Yes, and so afterwards, um, uh, leave Sado and also could say goodbye to, uh, Salvatore and Kenichi. And they uh, went off with his, uh, well, well, what's going to happen to him afterwards, unknown. And that was the end of Udrum and Taro. Now, uh, there have been a lot of things I left out, but um, I did the best I could to remember uh, the important stuff. There probably some important stuff that I forgot to mention, but... Um, I couldn't uh, remember them all, probably because I wasn't able to review uh, this series as soon as I wanted to. But anyway, what I think of this series? Yeah, I think it was alright. And as for if uh, I forget to watch this, I don't recommend it. I mean, because of, uh, of certain scenes. I won't say what those scenes are, but um, yeah, I mean, I know uh, in Japan, standards for what can and cannot be in children's television is different than it is uh, in the West. Of course, with the way uh, children kids television, the direction children's television is going these days, they might start doing that stuff, but it doesn't make uh, things better. Instead, it just makes things worse. So, uh, yeah, I think that's all I can say about... Uh, Udurban Taro in this video and also please subscribe to my channel because it will help me a lot and also please share this video on social media like Facebook, Twitter or whatever. So that's it and I'll see you next time. Bye.